broadcasting live from my mother's apartment because she loves me and she gives me Wi-Fi. Delivery order for Sam Porter Bridges. Request transport of morphine to isolation ward for immediate administration to the president. Gotcha. Uh, welcome back, everybody. Uh, this is going to be a part two for Death Stranding. Uh, it's going to be pretty interesting, so just hang in tight with me. I do apologize if this gets loud. I just want to make sure that I got chat for you to be able to read your guys' awesome comments. Uh, if you like what you see, uh, make sure you uh, give me a like. It really, I really appreciate it, and it helps me out. Um, and don't be afraid to leave a comment. I always read the comment section, and yeah. So let's get right into it. You guys did miss a few things. There was a cutscene um, right after the last live stream. Um, unfortunately, I couldn't pause it. Uh, well, I could. It just it was a mess. So if I would have left the game, it would have been a big problem. Um, wouldn't have been able to save, so I would have had to do everything again. But we're back. Um, after a short little talk with Dead Man, uh, we have to take morphine to the president at the big uh, weird building. So, without a further ado, let's get to it. Beginning scan. Have a pleasant journey. Well, I appreciate it. The attention to detail in this game is really amazing, and it really... It's really impressive. Check the map on your cufflinks if you're lost, Sam. The isolation word should be pretty obvious. If you're not sure how to get there, you can set markers and draw routes too. Try it out and you'll see what I mean. Okie dokie. So we're gonna do this. I need to open my cufflinks. So we are going here. Destination uh, to the isolation ward. So if, there we go. Uh, I gotta remember how to plot. I think it's, no, it's not X, it is square. Drag and then drop. Sweet. So let's get right on a move. Oh, it's off limits. We need to go this way through the broken down city. Again. Sad. Your friendly neighborhood dead man here. <laughs> if you want to confirm you're headed the right way, check your compass. It'll never steer you wrong. Provided you have a destination, that is. Very true. Compass is L1. Oh, okay. Sweet. Didn't you just call me? Central wasn't just home to Bridges HQ. It was also the seat of the Reconstructionist movement. If the president Ooh. hadn't required special treatment, she would have never left. And if she hadn't, we wouldn't have either. This is true. All right, now this it would be good for a screenshot. Walk on in there, Sammy boy. Don't be afraid now, even though it is a big, scary building. And I'm going to mute my mic, so I do apologize for a loud pop. signs are all trending the same way. No chance of a recovery then? None that I can see. No. We should start making preparations. Sam! It's me. Dead man. Sorry. My mistake. I'm afraid the president's condition has deteriorated. Thank you. This will help to ease the pain. And allow her to speak with you in these final moments. Her? Huh? The first and last female president of the United States. Surely you remember her. 
She raised you? You're not exactly dressed for a reunion. Take that off before you come inside. That's the president's right-hand man, the director of bridges. Die hard man? Oh, you were with bridges one. So, I guess no introductions are necessary. What's it been, Sam? Ten years? Look at us. A bunch of deathless freaks meeting like this. Yeah, well, good to see you two. President's waiting. It's your mother, Bridget. She's a bit out of it, but I know she'll recognize you. Madam President, we've brought Sam. <sighs> we'll leave you two alone. Took her three years to cross. She's trying to rebuild the country. Still going on about that, huh? You're the one I wanted to send, Sam. Time's running out. Help Amelie. She needs you. Together, you you can help us reconnect. You can make America whole. Sam, if we don't all come together again, humanity will not survive. We don't need a country. Not anymore. We do. Alone, we have no future. No, America's finished. Bridget, you're the president of Jack shit. Sam, listen to me. <laughs>
I love you, Sam. I'll be waiting for you on the beach. <gasps> Madam President! Oh, no. Doctor, we need your help. Listen, no one can know that the president is dead. If word gets out, Bridges is finished. Now, what happened here does not leave this room. Do you understand? Yes, Director. But there's still the matter of the body. Without corpse disposal. We've got that covered. Sam, before she died, the president made a contract with you. What are you talking about? As a member of Bridges, you're gonna work with the rest of us to rebuild America. You think you can recruit me? Like she tried to? Well, she succeeded. Look at your wrist. If that's not symbolic, I don't know what is. Director, the cancer spread throughout her entire body. Harvesting organs is out of the question. And there is no need for an autopsy. Her body needs to be cremated before she necrotizes. And if we don't, this place will turn into another crater. What do you want me to do? We don't have any porters right now. And the CD team you went into the field with are dead. But the president's body has to be burned. The road from Capital Knot City to the incinerator was compromised in the void out. Now, the only way there is on foot, through the mountains. But the chiral density there is off the chart. It's gotta be BTs. This job has requirements. Tombs. Repatriate. So me? Why? Sam, you're already on the clock. Now get it done, Sam Border Bridges. President Strand believed in American Reconstructionism. She worked tirelessly to bring the nation together again. And without her, there would be no bridges. She deserves a funeral with full honors. But we can't give her that. If she dies, America dies. Without her, 
bridges will cease to be. Listen. Her cremation must be carried out with the utmost secrecy. Even if we pull it off, what then? Who's gonna take her place? Face it. America's history. Sam, America isn't dead yet. He just said that it dies if Bridget dies. She may be lost to us, but we still have an America worthy of the presidency. Sorry, what? Let's not get into it now. What matters is that we're going to finish your mother's work and rebuild America as she intended. That's the reason Bridges exists. So take the first step, Sam, and deliver the president's body to the incinerator. If we don't all come together again, humanity will not survive. You're the one I wanted to send, Sam. Time's running out. I love you, Sam. I'll be waiting for you on the beach. The facilities to the southwest. Remember that you'll be passing through BT territory. We built the incinerator way up in the mountains, so that the chiral matter in the smoke wouldn't reach the city. It won't be easy, carrying a body up there. We'll be monitoring you around the clock. If anything comes up, we'll offer you support via the cufflinks. Sorry, I dropped my controller. That is thumbnail worthy right there. Yeah, I do apologize. Dropped my controller. It was sitting in my lap. All right. I guess we take our mother to the incinerator before she never dies. Oh, phone call. Sam, this is Guy Hartman. Dead men explained how to use the cuffs, right? Use them to check the location of the incinerator. Yup, yup. Will do. Okay, so location of the generator is up in a mountain. So what we'll do is we'll oop again, wrong button. Hold X. Drag it over here. That way I know which way to go. And we'll be right on our merry way. So I'd like to take this time. Oop. Again, another phone call. Sam, I don't think I need to remind you, but every minute counts when transporting corpses for disposal. 48 hours following cardiac arrest, they go necro and become a fresh PT to make our lives hell. Okay, any more phone calls? No? Okay. I'd like to take this time to make a shout out to Spikiest Maple, aka my stepbrother, for becoming for becoming for becoming a U.S. Navy sailor. Congratulations, Mr. Marcus! I appreciate your service, sir, and I look forward to seeing you whenever uh, you get on break. <laughs> so, congratulations, bro! Uh, you're doing quite a service for the United States, and I appreciate what you're doing. And without a further ado, let's get back into the game, shall we? So it's going to be a pretty good hike. Another phone call. President Bridget Strand was the symbol of American Reconstructionism. Even with the country shattered and its people scattered to the four winds, she never stopped believing they could be reunited. People held on to their hope that America would rise again because they believed in her. We believe that this country can be rebuilt. America lives on, together with Bridget's undying spirit. Hmm. Interesting, interesting. But I'm just a porter. I'm carrying a, a lot of weight. I gotta do all this by myself. 
couldn't have gave me a truck at least or a bike like in the beginning because that would have been cool have a pleasant journey nah, I appreciate it thank you all right coming up on our first watchtower we can use this to spot dangerous areas and a bunch of other stuff such as chiral crystals other packages we'll take a look at that and we'll give her some likes Thanks for Come the on, help. give me up to at least 50. Yeah, yeah. can we get 100? Yeah! 104 likes. Now let's use this watchtower. What we got here? We got a ladder over there. Ooh. This looks to be just a ladder. No chiral crystals, no packages? Okay. Alright, let's get on our merry way. And try not to fall over. Yeah, yeah, just like that. Sam, you talking to yourself again. Alright. With a good 800. Oop. Hold on there, Sammy boy. I'm not falling over just yet. Let's take a quick stop. With a good 885 meters. We're going to have a heck of a time coming up that mountain there. Now again, like I said in the first stream, I'm not too worried about if um, this video gets claimed by copyright. I want to show the game for what it is, you know, and not try to hide any special parts or waste or try to, you know, find something to cut out the music. Speaking of music. Bones by Low Roar, courtesy of Nevada Music. Nevada, sorry. Nevada, Nevada, however you guys pronounce it. Don't get me wrong, it's really good music. But um, from the videos I've watched um, on this game, uh, they are copyrighted. So, the videos may be uh, blocked in some countries, but... You know, it's something that I'm going to have to deal with as a streamer. But if you guys are wondering what console this is, this is PS4, not out on Xbox. Um, so with that being said, there is a lot of cool controls, um, such as the motion controller. You can actually use that uh, for the BB. Uh -huh. And for other things, which it's it's really cool. I love the PlayStation, um, especially with the DualShock 4 controller. Um, should I just call him a name? But I think it's really nice. Um, the PlayStation 4 is. Um, I'm excited to see what the PlayStation 5 has to offer. But going from Xbox to PlayStation was a really big thing. I'm gonna give this dude some likes. 38, that's not bad. Oh. We need the ladder. There we go. But it's really interesting to go from or from Xbox to PlayStation because everything is so different. Even the controller is. Now there are some games like Grand Theft Auto V and uh, Destiny that have pretty much the same control layout. That's why it's easier to play games transferring from Xbox over to PlayStation. It's easier to play games that you're already familiar with, the controls. Uh, the only thing that's kind of weird is the um, joysticks. So they're, for the PlayStation, it's straight on. You know, the Xbox has theirs at an angle, which I think the Xbox is a little bit more comfortable. Um, but it is what it is, really. But I'm not gonna lie, I enjoy the PlayStation. I thought I'd never like it. Um, I did have a PlayStation 2 back in the day. Um, I know me and dad used to play it all the time. I remember that, it was early, early childhood. 
But me and Dad used to play PlayStation once in a while when he wasn't at work, and I think that's where my love for PlayStation came in until we got the Xbox 360. Of course, the PlayStation, I think, broke eventually, and we just got rid of it, but... Um, I really liked the PlayStation. But when I got into the 360, it was non-stop buying games that I really enjoyed, you know. That's something that got me into gaming heavily. So I do enjoy both consoles. Um, I can't really pick which one's better. Uh, because to me, they're just gaming consoles. They're... You know, they're just something to play games on. And I'm not going to sit here and hate on somebody for, you know, their choice of whether they like PlayStation or not. Um, same way with Xbox. So let's see where we're going here. Do we want to go up the mountain? Okay, this would be an easier trail to go up through here. Um, instead of climbing straight up that mountain here. Um, so we are going to... Cut up the mountain through here. And we're gonna have some fun. I'm Sam! So if you do push right on the trackpad, the right button on the trackpad, um, you can do call outs and stuff like that. So I know some people were, may have been confused on that on the when the game was still new. Um, yeah, people, it would confuse a lot of people when he would uh, do callouts on his own. But yeah, that's how you do Over that. Here. Anybody hear me? Some of the interactions are funny. I'm not gonna lie. Thank you, Eagle, for putting those out here. Oh, hold on there, Sam. Easy there, Sam. I got you. Alright, we're going to come up to this plane. We can use it. Go ahead and grab it now. That way we have it. And uh, for anybody that's played this game before, um, I know there is an online where um, other people can help and I can use their devices, but I like playing this just vanilla for the game it is. Um, so that's the place. Um, with all the stuff that's probably scattered out there, I know it helps, but I just like to show this for just regular gameplay and not what the online's like. The online is pretty nice because there are stuff that can help you along the way from other players that's placed items and stuff. But I like to do this on my own. the incinerator. Go ahead and get this business done. I'll mute my mic because I know there's a cutscene here.
rapidly. Heavy timefall is imminent. Get back here, now. Sam, burn the other cargo while you're there. What's this? BB-28. It's the unit Igor was assigned. It was hooked up to you when we found you in the crater. But why is it here? Because it's flagged for disposal. Central Knot's gone, and our headquarters along with it. Because that thing didn't do its job. It's all in Igor's logs. But it's still alive. It can't be repaired. And it can't survive outside the pod. Pity it if you want. But the decision has been made. It has to go. The director approved the order. Cutscene and right into the fire. Keep low. Move cautiously. If I'm not mistaken, there we go. We're gonna have to keep an eye out, make sure we don't run into the BTs. Because that is not fun. There's one right there. If I remember, how do I. Hold my breath. Okay, it's that fun. So I wanna watch out for that dude. Last time I tried to do this, I ended up running into a bunch of BTs, and that was not a very fun idea. There's one right over top of me. There's another right on top of me. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, go, go, go. I need to breathe. Don't 
caught. Don't get caught. Don't get caught. Come on. Almost there. We just gotta sneak past this dude. It's okay. We're okay. There is one right there. Oh, I'm in such trouble. Three, climb. Hang in there. We should be almost out of this. And I just got caught. That was the greatest mistake. Run, 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 I am stuck in this one spot. Go, 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 go. Get off me, 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 get off me. Uh-oh. That was close. Grab the rope and just disappear. There we go. Repel on down. You're fine. See, that was easy. I just gotta be careful for myself. I'm the biggest danger to myself. Down, 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 down. There we go. Press the balance. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. And you're taking a tumble. Oh, that was more of an adventure than I wanted that to be. Oh, and I had Mitch on my forehead. Oh, boy. That was a bigger adventure than I wanted that to be. And now we're just going to run back to base after that massive headache. Oh, I can drink my canteen. I will gladly... I gotta figure out what buttons what again. I'm surprised after everything that has happened in this game, Monster Energy is still around. So that was an adventure. Give me just a second. this water like low roar makes some really good music I'm not gonna lie really good music what's this water like okay it's yellow right there we're fine just keep on trucking Sammy boy Almost there. What is the distance left? 325, that's not bad. 
What do y'all think? Do you think we ought to do two missions? Make this a two-hour episode? I'm going to have to buy myself a different chair. Right now I'm sitting in a plastic yard chair and it kind of sucks. You don't get that lumbar support and it just sits there and crushes your back. Sweet, we're back at Capital Not after that disaster. Hello? Sam. Yes, sir? Come back to the distribution center. Check the location on your compass. I'm already there. Alrighty. Sweet cutscene. Let me mute my mic for this cutscene and let you guys enjoy it. Someone with dooms hooks up to a BB. Your feelings and memories cause feedback, like with the speaker. It amplifies fears and stress and runs the risk of taking you to a place from which you will not return. I'm sorry, but this BB has been pushed beyond its limits. This also is the only option. Sam, get cleaned up and come to the president's office. We need to talk. Sam, I thought I told you dooms and BBs were a dangerous combination. Huh, perhaps a shower is in order. You're still covered in chiralium. Don't want the president to see you like that. The hell are you talking about? She's dead. <sighs> You're upset. Is this about BB-28? Go fuck yourself. I'm not your errand boy. Well, in any event, it seems it owes you its life. No, we owe the kid our lives. You too. As you say... I shall look after it. Give my regards to the president. It's almost time to go, Sam. Here. It's a dream catcher. Wear it when you sleep, and I'll keep the nightmares away. I'll always be with you. Good morning. 
morning, Sam. Sam, this is Di Hartman. There's a private room set aside for your use. Bridges perk. Take a moment to clean up, wash all that chirelium off, then come to the president's office. Alrighty. Nice cutscene. Nice. Whoever seen BB flip off Dead Man was the, that's the funniest thing. Now there are a couple cool things about this being in the safe house. Norman breaks the third wall, and I'm gonna show that now. This is funny too. Come on, do the thing. That's the funniest part. Gives you the middle finger, and here we go. <laughs> <laughs> There's a couple more to that as well. I'm going to show you guys. Well, one more. Because why not? See, so like towards his torso. He's flexing at you. And this one I didn't quite understand. <laughs> why? Alright, let's take a look at our little action figurines. Whoa, we're getting a little too close there, Norman. So we got a truck and some people. Nice, nice. Just want to show off the room for you guys if you haven't played this game. Got some BTs over here as well. Action figures and some monster energy. And of course the cool sunglasses. We're gonna take a drink of our monster energy drink. How they survive uh, to all this game theory and everything else, how they survive in this apocalypse is beyond me. But, it's still pretty cool. So we're going to get out of there. There's the mirror as well. We'll get to that. The mirror is pretty funny too. There's some actions that you can do. Alright. Okay. So it's all directional. And I believe there's one more. I'm trying to get the funny one. It's not this one. Oh wait, yeah it is. No? No, I was wrong. Okay. Now back to gameplay. Let's head on over to the shower. And let's continue our quest. No, your feet don't look too good. What's that? Can you hear me? Oh, for fuck's sake. Is it anything private anymore? Oh, uh, no. Except for taking a shower and going to the toilet, that is. I take it you were getting yourself cleaned up. Good. Come to the president's office as soon as you're done. She's waiting for you. You did well, Sam. Thank you. Bridget may no longer be with us, but her legacy has a chance to live on. Sam, listen to me. America. Reconstructionism. Her dream isn't dead. I don't want to hear it. This is the face of our new hope. Our new America. Oh. 
Amen. My mother may be gone, but I'm here. And you, Sam? You're here too. Been ten years since you saw each other, right? And in all that time, she hasn't aged a day. He knows why. My body's still on the beach. I don't get to grow older. But you do, Sam. You look good. So you're serious, then, about reconnecting everyone and everything? Someone has to succeed Bridget, Sam. More importantly, someone has to carry on her legacy and see our country rebuilt. Samantha America Strand, our new president. A new beginning for our people, for our nation. Under Emily's leadership, we'll reestablish the UCA, the United Cities of America. This is how we'll rebuild our country. But we'll need your help to do it, Sam. No, I'm through with this. I said my goodbyes to all of you when I said them to Bridget. We never forgot about you, Sam. You ran away. You cut us off. Emily put together an expedition. The best of Bridges won. And went west. them past craters in BT territory. I kept them safe while they searched for survivors. Never once missed a BT. Saw them coming a mile away. We convinced community after community to join the UCA. And we left behind our own people to help them. It took us three years, but we managed to make it all the way to Edgenaut City. All the way to the Pacific. Jesus. Yeah, but then everything went to hell. The team was wiped out, and Emily was taken. Taken? I'm not being kept in a cell or anything like that. I'm allowed to use their facilities and to speak with you whenever I want. I just can't leave the city. It's all to safeguard the continued independence of Edgenot City. Well, that's what her keepers are saying, at least. They want the UCA to leave them be. Emily's their insurance policy in case we don't. Who are these assholes again? Homo demons. Militant separatist group. They run Edgenot City. I've heard of them. Bunch of terrorists who go around towns killing people and leaving craters. Right. Nothing's off limits for them. Not even engineering void outs. You think the suicide that took out Central Knot was one of theirs? Could be. There are extremists like the demons everywhere, plotting in the shadows. They're decentralized by nature. No one organization to rule them all. Just a common ideology. I know not everyone shares our vision for the... Americans don't come together again. Humanity won't survive. I carried my mother's message to people all across the country. But not everyone was willing to accept it. ...to themselves. Go it alone. Like you, Sam. They think that America can only be rebuilt by force. By men who tell them what to do. Who take away their freedom and put them in shackles. What'd you put on me, huh? You know better than the demons. Just another kind of cult. They're not shackles, Sam. They're a symbol of our bonds. 
That's what we need right now. Not to stand apart, but to come together. To form chiral knots and reconnect. Sam, we want you to go west and finish what Emily started. The people she left behind have been hard at work, setting up chiral network terminals. But these terminals are still isolated. We need you to bring them online. And for that, you'll need a Cupid. This contains all the necessary security and operations protocols to integrate a terminal into the chiral web. Take the Cupid West, Sam, and reconnect the people of our great nation. And when you get to Edgenot City, find Emily and bring her home. After that, I'll take over the presidency and carry on Mother's work to save the country. This was Bridget's dying wish. This is how we'll move forward. Please, Sam. We need you. I'm Sam Porter Bridges now. I'm not a strand. Hell, I'm not even part of this outfit. You all saw to that. I'm not getting involved with you or anyone else ever again. Wait! See? It's like I'm not even here. Same as it ever was. Sam! Sam! Hold on! Stop! Listen to me. America needs you. Both of you. Yeah, covering the world in cable didn't bring an end to war and suffering. Don't act surprised when it all comes apart if you try to do it again. Round and round it goes. Connect, reconnect, it's not that simple. All right, all right, Sam. Just take it easy. I get it. You don't have to commit to anything now. Why not get some rest? Good idea. We all need our sleep. Leave it too long and you're liable to reconnect with the other side. The necessary maintenance has been completed. Various adjustments and fine-tuning for your benefit. You can use it again. For once, it would seem that Dooms and BBs are a good combination. <laughs> or perhaps the two of you have something of an affinity for one another. Sam. Listen. You are Sam Strand. No, I'm not. Not anymore. My name is Sam Porter Bridges. It's a funny word, strand. A strand is part of rope or bond. While stranding means being washed up on the shore. And being stranded is when you can't go home. I'm stranded now, Sam. Here on the shore of the Pacific. Thousands of miles away, but our bond still holds.
You're free. But we're still connected. Don't tell me we're not. Sam, this is Die Hardman. You were out like a log. Must have been beat. Private rooms come with all the basic amenities. Shower, toilet, etc. Drop in when you need to rest. Inspect your gear, review info, or whatever else. If you have any questions, feel free to ask our staff. But before you do, why not check things out for yourself? See how Bridges operates these days. Sweet. Yes, Norman. BB is over there. So we're going to check on BB. Since that's what Norman wants to do. And we're going to check out the outfits as well. I'll show those off. Sam, this is Deadman. I calibrated your BB based on physiological data we collected from you earlier. It's still just a best guess, though. After you take it out for a spin, we can check if you're in sync and tweak the BB sensitivity as needed. Oh, okay, okay. And now we're gonna move on to the outfit. This case will remove any chiral matter still clinging to your suit. Uh, speaking of suits, blue is for delivery personnel, red for medical, orange for corpse disposal, and black for security. Nice. And I could change the color scheme on like the glasses and stuff, which I think I'll do that right now. I like to change them to match the outfit. There we go. Oop. There we go. All right. Now, let's get on to some orders, shall we? Oh, I gotta continue to look around. I think, if I'm not mistaken, it is. You know what, let's use the bathroom. Sam, Hartman here. Hello. Researcher devoted to uncovering the secrets of the beaches and the death stranding, as well as those of dudes and repatriates. When you relieve yourself, a certain amount of chiral matter is flushed from your system. Chiral matter can adversely affect hormone secretion and nervous function. There's a correlation between exposure and the development of phobias, as well as in extreme cases, violent and suicidal impulses. Oh. Chirelium contamination has even been postulated as a trigger for the onset of dooms. Allow me to collect a sample of your excretions for my studies. They provide a non-invasive means to monitor your exposure to chirelium and your overall health. Okie dokie. Can I leave now? Nope, I gotta check everything out. So let's check the map out here. With that terminal there, you can browse the bridge's database, which has info on a range of subjects. You don't have clearance for everything, but there's still plenty you might find informative. 
Sweet. Okay. There's that. Now, I believe... Okay, we need to check these out. Hey there. Believe we've met. I oversee delivery operations as well as maintenance and repairs. Nice to have you on board. I'm Mama, in case I didn't mention it before. Those there are strands. Not just used for packing, by the way, but for identification, too. Take a closer look and you'll see. See the red there? That's your blood. Oh, so I got my blood in a rope now. Does that mean I could strangle BTs with it? And I believe that was the final thing to check out. Yep. Well, have you had a chance to think it over? Chalk full of Chirelium, but safe for you Dooms guys to wear. That's all you'll need to go forth and reconnect the world. To make us whole again. I'm a porter. I don't care about connecting anything. Or making knots. But I'll do what I have to, to help Amelie out. Listen up, Sam. The terminals Amelie's people built in the towns and cities they passed through on their journey west are called knots. The infrastructure's there, but the Cairo network is offline. Right now, it's only capable of transmitting voice communications, sometimes wired, sometimes wireless, and a small amount of data. So, unless the necessary data stored on site, our chirograms won't show up. Emily and the other Bridges members you've seen around the place are grams generated with local data. In case you didn't know. Anyway, all you've got to do is find the knot, connect your cupid, and bring Cairo communications online. Once you connect it to the terminal, you'll be able to initiate zero-time massive data transmission with the UCA network. And just like that, you'll reconnect us not only to each other, but to our past. All the lost and fragmented junk data will be compiled and restored. Like bringing a dinosaur back to life from a fossil. Four point six billion years of history on Earth. All the wisdom and knowledge we lost since the Death Stranding will be ours again. And that, my friend, is how we'll beat this thing. Once you establish Cairo Communications, generating grams won't be an issue. You'll also be able to use Cairo printers. Won't be long before we're able to send all kinds of things through the wire. Except anything original. Or that's got a soul. Nothing real. Just copies. True. Which is why we'll still need porters like you. Before and after we're made whole, we'll need men in the middle. No rest for the wicked, huh? Yeah, well, idle hands and all that. We'll give you the details at the dispatch terminal. Make sure you check it upstairs. Drop's waiting up there, too. These shoes look like they've done some serious miles. Shall I dispose of them? 
Wait. Hold on. There's something I want you to look into. My blood seemed to set those things off. Happened more than once. Set them off? How do you mean? I don't know. You took my blood, didn't you? You tell me. All right. I'll see what I can do. Hmm. Okay, right back in we go, shall we? Let's go to this terminal and uh, get some missions. Sam, this is Die Hard. Your current objective is to extend the Chiral network from here to Port Knot City. But don't think you can make a beeline straight for it. Signal won't carry that far. To cover the distance, we need to utilize knots. Think of it like tying ropes together to make a longer rope. The first of these knots is a bridge's way station. Go ahead and take a look at the order. Deliver whatever they need and connect the cupid. All right. So you're gonna go here to the way station. Sam, order summaries may contain information critical to your success. Make sure to review them before getting underway. Okay, okay. Uh, I hope you know I'm not going to read any of that. And we're going to carry all on back. Sam. Yes, sir. We've supplied you with some rope and a ladder for this run. Nice. It should help with the steeper inclines, and the ladder will also make a halfway decent bridge if you need to cross a river. Right now, I figure you're thinking about how you want to handle this order. Yeah, I think I can handle it. Can load all on back. And we're going to do this auto arrange. So that way everything's evenly distributed. And we're going to head on out to our adventure. Okay, so we're gonna go here. So what I'm gonna do? Oh, hello. Oh, I can't drag. Oh, I'm pushing the wrong button. Uh, all right, so we're gonna go from here to here. We're gonna cross here. We're gonna cross here. And we're probably gonna go down this way. And we're going to go over here. And we're going to go pretty well straight from there to here. Perfect. Let's get going. Have a pleasant journey. I appreciate it. Thank you, sir. Yeah, sure thing. Sam, 
Yes, sir. Triple check your loadout, I take it. I did. Okay, we can urinate. We got our stuff. Sweet. All good to go. I was gonna say, you still want me to do that again? Let's get on a move, shall we? Hello. Sam. I just talked to you. Someone left over there. You can leave some of your own if you'd like. Messages, warnings, words of encouragement. Give some likes. 55. Sweet. Me a hold of L1 and triangle. Oh, sweet. Yeah, let's put down a great view. Let's get on a move. I already see B Terry territory from that strand over there. So we're gonna try to avoid as many of those as we can. Another phone call. Sam. Yes, sir. Even the best porters have been known to lose their cargo. But you're better than the best. You've got what it takes to finish what they started. If you come across any abandoned shipments, Consider taking them to their intended destination. It's easier than you might think. See, all our packages are tagged with Bridges IDs for easy tracking. And your Ojo deck is equipped with a scanner which might detect said IDs. First is a roundabout way of saying, but that thing on your shoulder can help you locate mislaid shipments. Good to know. No, I'm not going to be picking up... Oh, okay. Remember, Sam. Every parcel is a promise made to a person in need. And they're counting on you to deliver. Well, I'm sorry, but those people are going to be mighty disappointed. Unless it's on the way or wherever. I don't think I'll be picking up any cargo. Yes, sir. A well placed ladder could get you safely across most rivers, you know. Yeah, Maybe I know. Using the one we issued you. Okay, you've caught me already six times. And here comes the time fall. Sam, Again. Hello. Remember that prolonged exposure to time fall damages cargo containers. Don't yes, stay I am aware. any longer than you have to. Okie dokie, Captain. Going to BT territory. Yeah, I feel you. As long as I don't get caught again by another one of those, we'll be just fine. I'm gonna do a scan. That was my fault. Oh, please no. I'm already making them all mad. Just run some. And I just made another one mad. Oh boy. Yes, I know, BB. Oh, boy. Oh, 
Oh, we're safe. You're clear of PG territory. Yeah, I noticed. Blame for all of this. The gazers, the fall of America, everything. I need to go this way. World beyond recognition. Humanity had to scramble like rats fleeing a sinking ship. But there's nowhere else to go. There's no future living like this. If we're to survive, we need to find another way. A way to overcome the BT. Not going through there. Ah, oh, there's a little bit of a hike. I think we're gonna go up this way and then cross. Yeah, because that's a little deep. And we're gonna cross right here. Yes, I know, BB. We're almost there. Sweet. Come up here. Right there is where we're heading to that big building. I'm gonna get a drink of my monster real quick. How are we doing? Okay, this gets pretty deep right here. Gonna hold on tight and just keep on keeping on. Right. I'm gonna hit this checkpoint here. Almost there. Just a couple, uh, maybe about a hundred meters, and we'll be safe. Yeah, we'll go through these rocks. Bob and weave, Norman, Bob and weave. Here we are, way station of Capital Not Way Station West of Beginning Capital Not City. Scanning bridges ID. Verifying ID. Clear. Cargo verified. Thank you. Sweet. And on record time too. Make delivery. Should be in mint condition, sir. I took this very care. Very good Thank care. Thank you again. Yeah, everything no problem. Be in good order. And soon our way station will be too, I hope. I know, I know. I'm the best. Gonna auto skip all this. 1,681.9 meters. That's a pretty good distance. I'll just skip all that. Second team, right? Where are the others? Dead. Caught in the void out. No way. That one blast got them all. And what, they just sent you out on your own? I mean, if it was just a delivery, that'd be one thing. Porters come through from time to time, but... The second team was meant to bring the Cupid. They were gonna connect us up. Three years we've been waiting for help. Three years! And they sent us one guy who... Shit, shit, shit! Tell me you brought more than the Oxy, at least. I've got the Cupid. You... Really? So it's true? They finally got it working? Well, then you just might be the answer to my prayers. So, what are you waiting for? But you, you put us on the goddamn grid? Here comes the best part about this game, this big meaty sound right here. Everybody hold on. 
<laughs> Sweet, they're on the grid. New strand established. They have joined the UCA. Sweet. Got a post box. New fabrication stuff. Nice, nice, nice. Connection to Capital Not City confirmed. It's really happening. <laughs> Just like Amelie promised. Yes, we sir. Do what we came here to do. Hey, you're headed west, right? Yep. And a lot of people happy to see you. I guess you'll keep on until you hit the coast, huh? Which means you'll get to see Amelie in person. Oh, that's something. That is really something. I... Me, I've never met her. Only seen her hollow messages back when I was with the first expedition. Well, anyway, you best be careful on the road. There's some bad people out there. More than good, some say. <sighs> but I don't need to tell you that. Thank Hello. you, Sam. By bringing that way station into the Cairo network, you've put it in direct contact with those of us back here in Capital Not City. Right. What's next? West of the way station are a couple of structures our previous expedition put in place. And beyond them is your next destination, Port Not City. It's on the shore of a crater lake that formed after the first void out. Your objective is to link up Port and Capital Not. But to do that, you'll need to utilize our facilities as additional waypoints. They'll be essential for establishing a stable connection. Given the distance we need to cover, we're looking at using a distribution center and a power station, as to which you should head for first. Start with the distro center. We've got some cargo that needs delivering anyway. Check the nearby delivery terminal to pick it up. Good work. Sweet. New order available. Please access delivery terminal for further information. And ladies and gentlemen, I think that'll be it for this stream. I hope you all enjoyed. If you did, leave a like. Uh, don't be afraid to comment. And consider subscribing to the channel if you like this content and you would like to see more. I'd really appreciate it. It helps me out. shows me that I'm doing a really good job. Without further ado, I'm the Furry Marksman. And this has been Death's Stranding. Uh, there will be more episodes, most definitely, until I finish the game. But for now, I'm going to leave it here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. And peace out. Because I think it's like $5.